world uh, starting the vlog outside of the house today. Like, I'm nowhere near my house today. We are going to um, a, it's called the Black Ice Pond Hockey Tournament. They do it every year um, in Concord. I don't know how long they've been doing it for, but a decent amount of time. So we are gonna go and check that out. It's around noon time, so we may not stay for super long because we're gonna get kind of hungry soon. And I saw on the website that I think it said that it's a boot hockey, like mandatory boot hockey day today, just because it's been abnormally warm than like usual winter. So I think the ice is a little bit soft. So they may not actually be skating, which could potentially be a little bit more entertaining. We'll see. In past years, they've been a little snippy and a little feisty. I think the competition has gotten a little more intense over the years. So we're gonna check it out. It's like, legit, legit, legit. This is a full pond and they bring out little boards. So they have like mini boards and mini referees and scores and big clocks and time officials and all that stuff. Announcements, it's pretty cool. Why did I wear these shoes? Just saying to Alex, I have no idea. I was all focused on the outfit today. Wasn't thinking clearly. But I'm okay with it. I don't know, I just felt like being fancy today for standing outside watching hockey. It makes no sense, don't ask, I don't know. Pale and white, and the gear sides crippled and blue. That'd be our feature matchup. We're watching the feature matchup. Renegades have a, apparently. Renegades have a one goal lead over the Barley House. We're off now. The wafting scent of food was uh, a little bit more than we could handle, so I'm gonna see if we can find something now. I think there's some sort of dog obedience thing or something going on over there. I do not know. It's a bunch of dogs and I'm not sure what they're doing but they're in front of the Capitol. We are going to get lunch from the Barley House. Hopefully it's not packed um, with people just because of the pond hockey tournament going on but I think we should be all right. I forgot the gift certificate in the car. You see dogs are going nuts. This is like a really pretty black dog and this dog is going nuts. I think it needs the obedience course. some comfy clothes. I have a soup that I want to make for tomorrow so that I'll have it for work. Ugh. But right now I just want to put on some cuddle clothes because I feel a little fancy today. I don't even know why or what motivated me to be like I'm gonna be all fancy but I was motivated to do it and then I did it and now I don't want to anymore. I thought about filming a video so we have it for next week but just kind of petered out on that one and said nope but I have to make that soup so that I have it and also maybe have a little bit of dinner we had a lot of food at lunch and so I'm not really that hungry right now but we'll see maybe I'll have some of the soup once it's finished my giant gray blob is so much better now we can cook. Now we can get down to business and do what we gotta do. Okay, so this is like, uh, what I like to do whenever I'm starting to make a recipe or I'm gonna do you know, whatever, baking, dinner, whichever it is. I like to lay out all of my ingredients. So this is everything that's gonna go into the soup. It's a tomato tortellini soup, super simple. Not a ton of ingredients. I've taken screenshots of the recipe on my phone so I can still watch some YouTube or maybe some Heart of Dixie. I haven't said which while I'm making it, but I'm going to get to it. It seems pretty easy. I say that now. It's probably not that bad. So now you're supposed
supposed to blend the soup and there has been a little bit of a blending disaster. First try, it went freaking everywhere. Just gonna be a minute. Whatever you do, lover, do not come in this kitchen. Because you will judge me hard. Blending soup is not what it sounds like. Just trust me. The, the disaster zone that was behind me over there. Um, I think I missed a few steps, including stirring in a half cup of Greek yogurt and then adding the torts. I'm just waiting for them to cook up and then it's done. All right, I've made Alex and I some evening tea. I think I'm going to have some of these shortbread cookies with it. These are leftover from Christmas, but they are still good. They are these ones. They're my fave. But I think I'm going to end the vlog here. We're just going to hang out, get ready for bed, get ready for work tomorrow. I'm not sure how much I will vlog tomorrow or if I even will at all because we're going to have work and then head over to my grandmother's. A bunch of the family is getting together because it was her birthday on Thursday. Thursday, I think. Whatever the 27th was. Um, but I hope you all had a wonderful day or are about to have a wonderful evening. And I will see you guys, if not tomorrow, then on Monday.